Hello, my name is Vanessa and in this short video I want to speak about a really really important topic in international trade, namely sustainability. Today it is more necessary than ever to have a look at the environment and resources and also the people who are living at Mother Earth. The first question that arises here is what exactly is sustainable trade? So sustainable trade activities are generally oriented towards the production, the transformation and commercialization of products derived from the sustainable use of biological resources or the provision of services derived from such resources. But there's even more to mention. So sustainable trade stands for regenerating the environmental resources as these resources are almost everything we have. Despite that, it should reduce poverty and inequality because everyone should be able to participate and get included. And lastly, of course, generating economic value. The second question which arises here is, which functions does sustainability and in international trade actually have? So firstly, it is necessary to inform, raise awareness, and create demand for sustainable goods and services in export markets. Furthermore, sustainable trade can facilitate the harmonization and mutual recognition of multiple standards and the co-evolution of new standards and re regulations. And lastly, also strengths and capacities in developing countries for innovating in the design, management, and implementation of positive environmental labor and ethical initiatives. The last and most important question here is how to do sustainable trade. So the first step is creating an enabling policy environment at the national, regional and international levels that promote sustainable trade in biodiversity products and services. Also important is to increase the developing country supply capacity of goods and services derived from biodiversity. This requires increasing the levels of productivity, strengthening technical skills, improving technology, facilitating access to finance, and of course promoting alliances among the actors. Another point can be improving the market access and fostering market creation for biodiversity goods and services by enhancing the understanding of these markets, facilitating commercial contacts between exporters and importers, improving the market access, and of course, raising awareness among consumers. So when having all these points in mind, we can create a better understanding and fostering sustainable trade. I want to close this video with a short quote. So sustainability is a political choice, not a technical one. It is not a question of whether we can be sustainable, but whether we choose to be. So this was my short video about sustainability in international trade. I hope you enjoyed and thank you very much for listening.